Burnside, a heavily used road around here, was shut down today as crews repaired a landslide. And the Portland Bureau of Transportation says this is the largest landslide here in the city in about two years. We've had so much rain lately. Our Jacqueline Abad is live from Burnside with more on that tonight. Jacqueline. Jennifer, well, the westbound lane here on West Burnside is back open and you can see all the cars driving by, but the eastbound lane is still closed from Barnes to Skyline. That's because PBOT says there is still a risk of movement in the slide area. A small landslide pushed dirt and debris onto West Burnside this morning. The Portland Bureau of Transportation crews were out cleaning up the debris, loading it into dump trucks. Our trucks need to maneuver around and, um, and get that debris off the road and, st and stabilize the hillside. Peabot says this is the largest slide on a city street in two years. Actually very close to the site of the very large landslide that we had two years ago that closed that portion of West Burnside for, uh, for quite a while. After that incident, a retaining wall was put in place. Portland State Geology Professor Scott Burns says when you have steep hills, weak soil and a lot of rain in a short amount of time, you get landslides. And so we had the big earth, uh, big landslide uh, on, up on Burnside. That's the inauguration of the landslide season and we ha we'll be seeing quite a few more. Landslides vary from year to year and there are some things you can do to protect your home. The potential is out there for landslides to come and, and so it is uh, paramount for anybody who lives on a slope. Uh, if you've got a house out there, check your house to make sure that the water is draining off. And as crews continue to clean up West Burnside, pay attention to the road signs. If you go past the, past the sign, ignore the sign, not only are you endangering yourself, you're also endangering our crews. Um, and those signs are there for a reason. PBOT says that the eastbound lane will be closed through Monday or even longer. They have detours set in place if you plan on driving out in this area. Reporting live from West Burnside, Jacqueline Abad, Quinn 6 News.